Hey guys, it's like I said in my last video, um, I'm doing another room tour and 2021 has been an interesting year and it's been 11 months since I've done a room tour video. The last one I did was in January of 2021. So yeah, you guys notice some differences in here. I got a new bed frame because I wasn't feeling the headrest and footrest anymore. I got a new computer chair and yeah. But pretty much, that's pretty much it, I guess. I'm just uh, doing another video just to, I guess, to finish the year with this final video and heading towards 2022. And yeah, so let's just get started, shall we? Like always, here's the door, right here with the door stopper, uh, back scratcher, don't ask, car keys, duster, uh, my diploma or yeah, high school diploma and my associate's degrees. Um, I'm almost done getting my bachelor's. I have one more year or a, just half a year left, depending if I just want to do spring and then summer, that's half a year. Or if I do sp this upcoming spring and fall, that's one year. So yeah, here's my printer. Uh, this in here, this drawer, just paper, copy paper and pencil pouch. In here is just uh, loose paper with uh, empty notebooks and uh, I think like the lower back support and the pillow for my computer chair. But yeah, so there it is. And here's my closet for the first time. It's nothing too fancy. You got a dresser right here, some pants, shirt, and my uh, boxes for my statues. So there is that. There's the mirror right here. And if we go to this bulletin board, there's really nothing too crazy. It's just a pennant for my, for the college I'm attending to with a Betty Page tin sign and a coffee tin sign. I just wanted to have something retro just to, I guess, compliment or coincide with the Fallout posters right here. Fallout 4 posters, but yeah. Got a little lamp right here. Got a new nightstand and my Nina Williams or Tekken Bishojo statue. Uh, because since this room has has more of a gaming inspired feel or look to it, so I decided to get this um, statue. There's the futon, a uh, coffee table with newer coasters because the Crash Bandicoot ones have been peeling off, so that's unfortunate. Uh, Spider-Man pillow, Spider-Man blanket, just to have, just in case if I have, uh, I guess, acquaintances or friends that come over, but yeah. Here's this like lamp shelf looking thing with the Spyro statue, the Re Reignited Trilogy, and then a pencil holder, which also holds my phone there, so, and then a uh, cloth cleaner, which I just use as a mat for my uh, glasses, two more coasters, a water bottle, a Blu-ray controller, and a Roku TV controller, and a Crash Bandicoot, uh, Crash Bandicoot 4 statue, which also has a puck light right here, which, yeah, there you go, but I don't really have it on, but I just have it there just because, and my charger, like I said, new bed frame with, you know, I also have a new mattress as well, so. That's another thing I forgot to add, but pillows are the same. You got a body pillow because, you know, as a kid, I've always grown up having a body pillow as a kid. So that's what I'm used to. A comforter, a Spyro poster, a Crash Bandicoot poster, uh, my backpack, which I think this upcoming semester, I have to go to school, you know, in person just for one class, which to me is bizarre considering I rather prefer online classes. Uh, nightstand with the pencil holder and another coaster. And these are just like electronics, wires, HDMI cables, stuff like that. Uh, a stool just so I can use to get up and hang my posters and all that. A fan and a refrigerator. And let's see what's inside, which is pretty much just water bottles, uh, mugs, uh, ginger ale, some Kool-Aid stuff, candy cane, that kind of stuff. So yeah, first time showing my 
inside of my mini fridge. So there's that. And then windows right here. Uh, Batman Arkham Knight Batgirl poster with two plants, or they're fake plants, and a lamp in the middle, and another dresser slash nightstand, which I use for my Blu-rays right here. Right here. Uh, I think this is like just action figures and stuff, uh, medicine, and then these are DVDs in here. So, yeah. And then my TV right here which, and I also have uh, Logitech speakers for my TV. There's one subwoofer right here for the TV. This one right here is for my computer because I have another set of speakers for my computer. But yeah. And then here are just my books or novels from high school, early college, uh, a couple dictionaries, movie novelizations and all that stuff. And which also has a puck light right here. There you go, to really like display or shine um, my small book collection. But yeah, kind of makes me feel intelligent just having these books right here. But yeah, um, a paper shredder right there and my Batman wastebasket, a custom built PC. And then this gamer chair right here, it's a DX racer. And then another lamp webcam, pencils, pencil sharpener, that kind of stuff, a clock. And yeah, and I hope you guys had a great Christmas. So yeah, today is December 26th, so it's 69 degrees in here. <laughs> and then uh, files right here, important documents are in there. And then um, my, what do they call these? These ultimate guides for DC and Marvel characters. So yeah. And that's pretty much my room, and I hope you guys had a great 2021, and uh, wish you guys nothing but the best and happy new years for 2022. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, and will I do any more videos in the future? We will see, because I'm not sure. I don't really think on planning on doing any more toy reviews or even DVD or Blu-ray collections, so we'll see at this point. We will see. Maybe this is like the definitive look for the toy room. Or not toy room, but this is more of a home office bedroom room tour. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So yeah, guys. See you guys in 2022. Oh yeah, and I'm on the on my computer. I'm on the web version of Instagram. But if you guys really want to follow me, I'm on Instagram. That's mostly where I post my stuff. And I'm. this is the only social media I have that I'm really active on. So, yeah, just a note.